Hey guys, what's going on? It's Eclipse here and today I have a pretty epic video for you guys. So right now as I'm making this, I do not think any other YouTubers have made a video regarding this topic at all. So today I'm making a video on my channel and then T-Bot is making a video on his channel as well. So me and T-Bot are collaborating and we both put some time into this video to find pictures and research this topic. So if you guys want to check out T-Bot's video, a link to his channel will be down in the description below. So without further ado, do let's talk about negative gems so that is right negative gems so some of you are probably asking yourself yo eclipse what the hell are you talking about what are negative gems so right here i'm just going to show you the first picture and as you can all see he has negative 662 gems so this guy you're seeing right now is actually in the sister clan of my main clan and that's how i first discovered this topic he posted this in my clan's group meet chat and i was super confused so the negative on this looks super weird it looks super Super out of place and I can assure you guys that this is not photoshopped and I do actually have like the cause and solution for why this happens so if you're curious on why this happens and stuff like that just stay tuned until the end of the video and I will explain it there but as you can see this just looks super weird super abnormal and for, like for the most part I've just never seen or heard of this issue before so I do actually have a second picture for you guys and in this picture he has negative 317 gems. So I wanted to show you a good picture and a non-good picture. So I wanted to show you this picture right here because it's taken from a phone and obviously I wouldn't be able to photoshop something on a picture like this. So I just wanted to show you guys two pictures so you can compare them to see that both of these negative signs look the same. I didn't do any photoshopping this is like a legit issue in Clash of Clans and guys this is another you know clan mate so without further ado let me just get right into the cause and tell you guys why this happens so this only happens to people who have Android products or people who are on the Google Play Store. I haven't heard of this happen to anyone who is on iOS. So let me just explain the scenario very quickly and hopefully it isn't too confusing. So what happens is people will buy gems, whether it's on purpose or on accident, they'll end up buying gems. So once they buy gems, they'll end up emailing Google and asking for a refund. And when they email Google, Google will give them their money back, but they'll also take those gems back that they earned in clash of clans so let's say you buy 500 gems so if you accidentally buy 500 gems and you're thinking to yourself like crap why did I just do that since you have 500 gems on your account obviously you're gonna spend some of those so let's say now you're at about 200 gems because you spend like 300 gems when Google gives you a refund they'll give you your money back but they'll also take away 500 gems so that will leave you at negative 300 gems since they take gems out of your account so hopefully that all made sense and hopefully that wasn't too confusing. Now the only way to get out of having negative gems is to buy more gems so that way you're positive gems. So this is kind of unfortunate for some people but that is what they get for refunding gems and a whole bunch of stuff like that. So now let's get right into the full explanation that Supercell actually gives these people once they get refunds. So Supercell said a refund was requested for this account and it has been approved on 2015 December 8th. The refund will be made to the form of payment used when the order was made. A total of 14,000 gems have been deducted from your account to match the value of your refund. This may result in negative gem balance. A positive balance can be restored by making additional orders and collecting resources in game. So that is it. That is absolutely crazy that Supercell is making people actually go in a negative balance and have to buy more gems just to get out. I have no idea, honestly, what to think about this. Hopefully this doesn't ever happen to me. I don't refund gems or anything like that. But I think this is kind of like a serious and stupid issue. And honestly, I'm just I'm kind of in shock right now when I read that because Supercell is basically, basically sorry, taking gems from people's account so they have to spend more money on their game to make them go up in gems. So this is kind of like an elaborate plan by Supercell or Google to make more money. So guys, this has been Eclipse. If you did find this video interesting at all, please give the video a like down below. And I would like to give a special shout out to Mr. Moo Moo or Mr. Moo Moo Cow because he is one of my clan mates who did inform me on this topic. So again, guys, hopefully you all did enjoy and peace out.